We are only one day away from the start of the Lumberjacks boys winter sports season. The fall will definitely be a tough one to follow up with all three teams making it to state. Action begins with the boys hockey team who are looking to improve on their 10-16 record from last year. It's year number two for Eric Mondrud, and that added year of working with the team has already shown some benefits. We were able to get everybody on the same page earlier than uh, in the past, and um, all these kids have put in their time. Uh, they've worked really hard. We're kind of ahead of the game than where we were last year. It's seen a lot of good chemistry. Everybody's got a good you know, mojo going. It seems like everybody's happy to be here and good energy. With the graduation of Matt Fitzgerald, there will be a new goalie between the pipes, an opportunity Brock Waldhausen has been waiting for for quite some time. Standing my whole career behind some great goalies, just waiting for my opportunity to do so. And uh, it's just great spending uh, all summer preparing for that. The team returned several key players, particularly with their forwards. And they say their strength will be their speed and their aggressiveness. I think we've got a lot of speed. Uh, got good goaltending. Uh, defense is pretty solid. Uh, I think with the forwards having all that speed, I think we're going to put the puck in the net. We're going to be aggressive this year, uh, man on man, stick on stick, just really showing them what we're about, Pemidji Hockey. Hockey Day Minnesota is of course one of, if not the highlight of the season, but the team is staying focused on the tasks ahead, including tomorrow's opener against War Road. It's pretty big, you know, everybody's thinking about it, but it's kind of important just to focus at the day to day at a time here and just focus on tomorrow night. Well, it's always been a good team, always good, always been a good first game. I think if we just stick to all the systems that we do and go out there and outwork them, we'll be just fine. Bemidji beat War Road in both matchups last year, 3 to nothing on the road and 5-2 to two at home. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.